Hi, Claire. I know it's 8 a.m. and you're exhausted and you got to go to school, but I really appreciate you taking time to tell me how it's going. It's been four weeks since your tongue tie release mm -hmm. and upper lip tie. Two upper lip ties. Two buckle ties and upper lip tie. Mm -hmm. And I, you're my first flute player that is feeling, that did this for the flute and, and for the Spanish, actually. And I was wondering if you could share with us how it's improved these things for you. Uh, with flutes specifically, there's a thing that you can do on the flute called double tonguing. And it's basically the idea that you go like, do 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 while you're blowing out. And it's really, it was really hard for me to do before because I could only do it as like, Ticka 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 ticka, since that involves moving your tongue differently and like with less motion, but that also makes it sound really short and like percussive and doesn't really give like the rich full tone you want from the flute. Uh huh. So uh, now that I got my tongue tie released, I can actually fully double tongue and it's made a huge difference in my playing. That's so cool. And how about for Spanish? Have you gotten to use it yet in Spanish? I know school uh, just started. I am not actually taking Spanish this year, so I'm not very good at it. So you haven't but been able to practice. I am not, and I also still don't get the theory behind it, but I think I, think I could. If... Okay. How about anything that you, I know that you just were excited for flute and for Spanish, but mm -hmm. and you didn't really have any neck tension before, but I'm curious if you feel even better with your neck than you did before. You didn't really realize you had tension? Mm. Yeah, I think it is better than it was before. I didn't really notice it because I usually have bad posture from being at the computer all the time, but it, my neck does feel better. And do you feel like your posture is better? I haven't really noticed any changes there. Okay. How about with your breathing, nasal breathing? Is it's, it easier? It's, it's so much better. With, I think that's from the lip ties, though. And you can tell a huge difference. Mm -hmm. Tell me how you can tell the difference because it's hard for me to explain to patients. Uh, it's a lot less congested. I was real. I used to be really, really prone to congestion, like all the time. Mm -hmm. It'd be like, oh boy, I'm awake now. Time to be congested again. Mm -hmm. I would get like randomly congested just lying down. It was awful. Uh -huh. But after I do my uh, stretches, it feels like I can just breathe normally with no congestion there at all, and it's crazy. That's awesome. How about you were in Invisalign for a while and my own race? And wondering if your teeth even feel different now. Like, does it feel more comfortable to bite down? Do your teeth feel like they're touching any different? Just curious. Uh, yeah, my bite feels more like good all around, and it doesn't feel like I'm just touching like one tooth to the other like it used to. Wow. So even though you had been in a design and finished in my race for a while, it wasn't until after the tongue tie release that things kind of felt settled. Yeah. Very cool. Do you wake up more rested or still about the same? Um. Because I figure if you're breathing better at night, you must be sleeping better. Usually more rested. I haven't been sleeping enough lately because, because of, school. of school. What grade are you in? Senior. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. So I just want to say that I had mentioned this to Claire a few years ago, and she had been thinking about it and processing it on her own. She came to me and said, I'm ready for this. I really want to do this. And she didn't even have myofunctional therapy. She just did the therapy I gave her with my oath brace, and she did amazing. I was so proud of her. She was very committed. We don't usually see this in a senior in high school, so hats off to you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh-huh.